Spurriushan, the Jain festival of penance and forgiveness is coming soon. During the festival, many Jains try and attend a group Pratikaman ritual. Some try and do their own personal reflection and forgiveness exercises. And many also fast in some way, from giving up root vegetables to attempting to drink only boiled water for one or more consecutive days. In addition to the activities you're already thinking about doing this year, we would like to invite you to consider also giving up dairy this pollution. We believe there's some very good reasons for giving up dairy, both during pollution and beyond. These reasons include non-violence, the environment, self-control and human health. For Jane's, non-violence is perhaps the most important reason. Many are aware that welfare conditions on dairy farms are poor, but poor conditions only scratch the surface of the violence humans inflict on cows through dairy production. The true extent of violence includes forceful impregnation, the killing of innocent male calves, and the early killing of retired dairy cows. To help understand why these activities are inherent in dairy production, we go through the dairy life cycle step by step. Just like all other mammals, cows produce milk to feed their offspring. And just like humans, they need to be pregnant before they start producing milk. In order to keep costs low and ensure high yielding offspring, dairy cows are forcefully impregnated through artificial insemination using the semen of carefully selected bulls. Once pregnant, a cow gives birth after around nine months, and the fate of the newborn calf is determined by its gender. Female calves can go on to produce milk like their mothers, but male calves are of no economic value to a farmer. Since it's costly to feed them, but there's no economic benefit to keeping them alive, most male calves are shot dead within 48 hours of being born. If looked after properly, dairy cows could live for up to 15 years. But after a couple of cycles of pregnancy, the amount of milk they produce begins to fall. At this point, it becomes more efficient for a farmer to replace the cow with a younger female. And since there's no economic value in keeping a retired dairy cow alive, farmers promptly sent these cows to the slaughterhouse too. For many Jains, understanding the full extent of violence inflicted on cows and milk production is enough of a reason to give up dairy right away. But there are other good reasons too. Indeed, many people have given up dairy on environmental grounds alone. As with many other livestock products, dairy requires a lot of environmental resources to produce and generates a large amount of greenhouse gases compared to plant-based foods. So much so, the analysis of UK government data suggests that a typical vegan diet may generate only around a quarter of the CO2 equivalent emissions of a lacto-vegetarian diet. In addition to reducing violence and environmental impact, giving up dairy can help cultivate self-control, which is very important in the practice of Jainism. And last but not least, giving up dairy can help make you healthier too. One of the key challenges in staying healthy is to avoid the temptation of highly processed foods which are rich in salt, sugar and fat. Giving up dairy can make it a lot easier to avoid these foods and make it easier to eat a diet which is rich in fruits, vegetables, beans and nuts. Whatever reasons you find most compelling, there has never been a better time to give up dairy. Alternatives to dairy are now widely available affordable and come in a diverse range of flavours to suit all tastes. And more members of the Jane community are giving up dairy than ever before, encouraged by a number of leading Jane organisations who are supporting the Give Up Dairy campaign. So we ask you to please consider giving up dairy this pollution and beyond. Whichever activities you end up participating in this year, we wish you a peaceful and spiritually uplifting Borussian 
and we seek forgiveness for any harm we may have caused in developing this campaign and video. Michami Dukra.